My name is Marco Siega, I'm the executive producer of the following. What can fans expect for this upcoming season? I think fans can expect uh, more of what we've given them that they love, the surprises, the twists, but also a, a sort of reboot. We really wanted to make the season accessible to uh, viewers that maybe hadn't seen seasons one and two and uh, bring people in to our world and have them enjoy it be without having to know all the backstory that we set up. So um, we're going to go back to what made this, the pilot special. We're going to bring in some flashbacks to fill in some of the blanks. Um, and those were always great to just give you some character development. And then uh, Ryan Hardy, uh, Max Hardy, and Mike Weston have big stories to resolve coming out of season two. So we'll deal with those, but again, in a way that, uh, in a way that feels new, in a way that lets the show evolve and move forward. Awesome. And what part do you think uh, Comic Con's fan, uh, Comic Con fans play in keeping your show alive? I think uh, the fan base that comes to Comic Con is the reason we're on the air. It's uh, uh, Kevin Williamson and I did um, Vampire Diaries together, and coming out of that show, we could see the power of the fans at Comic Con. We love genre shows, and this was always meant to be that. Um, we try to ground it a little more. Obviously, it, it's set in a in a more real world. But I think the fans at Comic-Con really appreciate uh, the soapy element. They can fall in love with our villains in a way that, uh, because they understand the world they come from in terms of how these stories are constructed. So they pay, play a huge part. Uh, we love Comic-Con for that reason. I think it's a big part of why we're here.